Hello, how are you people doing today? Is the music too loud? <clears throat> I don't know. Uh, it does not seem to be, at least according when I'm looking at the audio graphs, it seems okay, but... Mm. <laughs> there is music. Yeah, there is music. There indeed is music. Well, why wouldn't there be music? Don't, 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 don't lie. Yeah, don't lie. You're lying. You're lying. I just checked it. You're lying. Stop lying. Ah, oh, shit. Mm -hmm. What are you working on? Uh, I am working on a um, thing. Oh, right, so I'm doing this. <laughs> what are you working on? Uh, I'm a um, uh, uh, thing to capture a MQTT data and then uh, send it to Discord. Well, it's it's working right now. Well. Obviously not, but it, before I did stuff, it was working. Um, I don't yeah, there's a slight issue with it, so I'm uh, reworking it to actually work with uh, more data than it's currently handling or getting. Hmm. I'm going to disable hand tracking. Mm. Can I disable hand tracking? I should be able to. Oh, no, never mind. That's not what I wanted. Track hands. There we go. No hand tracking now. Yes, perfect. Hmm. Uh. Hmm. That's wrong. No. Okay, it is okay. Okay, it is okay. That's the wrong. Mm -hmm. 
There we go. Okay. Uh, Mm-hmm. Fantastic. Oh, oh. That's a um, good name. Protos, not Proto. Come on. But yeah, it was... Um, before it was taking a data as JSON, JSON, and it wasn't getting all that I wanted, so I'm making it use protobuf that the data actually is in um, uh, uh, in the, the, the in the MQTT. It's it, yeah, protobuf. So. Mm. File per folder. Where are? There we go. Copy folder. There we go. Oh, let's go. It worked now. Mm, perfect. Okay. Then we go spy. On the mqtt.js file. Mm, we want purge, 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 create none. I did no. know. Client on, that's what we're interested in. Um. Okay. Okay, yeah, it's uh okay it, um it's sending uh for right now it like most of the data is sent in uh JSON format in the Channel and then we also calls uh, it saves specific stuff to uh, MongoDB. Works no no like node infos. What what's the name of the what's the ID? How many yeah? What the hardware and how many hops it took and then position and telemetry. Our anything that note reports basically, and yeah, that's new. Yeah. I think I'm just gonna, you know, make a new, new file. But I can just, oh, yeah, I had a. Uh, Copy. So I can technically just this is my backup. So I'll just uh I think I'll just you know uh mm,
Yeah. So it's probably from that point on. Plant on. <laughs> so are we replacing this function? Hello, Bjorn. Uh, what I'm making is adding uh, more functionality to an already working one. Wait, what? That's too far. There we go. There we go. Uh, in basically, this is just taking um, data from MQTT. And, uh, well, anyways, I should probably in the, in my morning, so I will look around. And, yeah. In short, it, this is just taking data from MQTT and then doing funny stuff and then just um, uh, it sending it to discard discard uh, with web with webhook uh, in JSON in this channel and then um, it's um, working progress but it will it will send any messages there is and then of course if it sees a new node so it will send the node ID long name and short name. Yeah, and also, obviously, since uh, all the DMs go over the public channel, you can literally decrypt them and see what the messages are, but I'm not gonna show them. I'm just gonna send them a message that they like, a private message, private, private message, and then the long name of the person who the message was to. And of course, the webhook name is the who sent the message. Yeah. I've been pinged. Let me check. I probably should, you know, that's, that's the wrong, wrong button. There we go. Okay. Okay. So I do not have Prisma, so I'm just going to get them out of existence. Done. Get that out of existence. I'm probably just gonna, you know, um, probably add, you know, um, add um, Mongo DP thingy here, maybe later. There we go to uh, update the node status in the database. Um, decode service and... If collect service envelopes, try await. Them to decrypt encrypted packets, log known packet types, log unknown packets.
Did you see? Okay. So here, technically, I can add, uh, yeah. Mm. Mm. There we go. Mm. There we go. I'm just gonna console the envelope the packet. Mm. Ah, bleh. No, oh, control C, there we go. Uh, And here I would just be adding a um, <laughs> hmm. I'm just gonna Where I fucking forget I keep lifting the control. But that's uh Wait, what? Oh. Um I'm just gonna have a console dot log. Wait, what? So that's just, um... Oh no, my pair is on the already console that log for that one. <laughs> I'm not gonna even even sh show those right now because not necessary to console lock them. Okay, uh, there we go. <laughs> uh, 
attach. Uh, what did I do? I pressed uh, no. I don't know. Oh. Wait. No, okay. No, I... There we go. Get it up. Okay, this, okay. So technically I can just, I leave these over here. Or just that if statement go okay go over there so I'll just do that mm. I'll be using this Let's see ya. Mm, update no telemetry in DB. Huh. <laughs> 